Hello everyone, it's John from IT Skills Academy and today I present to you a forget password feature. This feature is part of the larger login system that can come in handy if one forget a password. For this to work smoothly, you need to provide your email address during registration. So it is this email address that we are going to use to validate or ensure that whoever is resetting the password is the real owner of the account. So once you provide the email address that um, you provided during registration, then uh, we can now be able to send um, some information to that specific email address. And upon accessing your email address, you're going to find a link that upon clicking, you can now be able to be uh, redirected to a page where you can be able to reset your password. Unfortunately, if you can't remember your email address, then this feature cannot work and you have to explore other ways. So let me take this opportunity to take you through the whole uh, system and this is just a simple uh, demo and in uh, the upcoming videos I'll be showing you how you can be able to create this step by step. So without so much ado, let's get started. So right now we are viewing the login system. So as I had mentioned earlier, uh, the forget password feature is part of the larger login system. That means for you to um, have this forget password feature, you need to have a login uh, page, you need to have a registration page, and they need to be working. So uh, if and when they are working, then you can now be able to add the forget password feature. Let me know in the comment section below if you may want me to create a video showing you how you can be able to create a login system. So having said that, let's get started. Okay, so um, on the login page here, I'm required to provide the email or username just to login. And I can just come and provide the specific username and the password. And I can say login. Let's hope that is the correct password. Yeah, you're going to forgive me because my machine is a little bit slow, so I'll just try to speed up this part. Yeah, and upon uh, providing the light credentials, you'll be redirected to this page, so it's just a sample of our page, it doesn't have anything. Yeah, because we're just interested with the um, what we call login system. So I can just uh, go back here and as you can see, um, the login uh, part is working like you can be able to successfully uh, log in. And just to test it, I can maybe deliberately provide the long password. Yeah, and as you can see on top here, it tells me that that is the long password. So it directs me to the same page with Anela telling me that I have provided the long password. So if you want to like get started, like um, to sign up, you can just come and click on the create account down here. And this should take you to the create account uh, page. Uh, as you can see here, you required to provide your username your valid email remember it should be valid because uh, when uh, you need to reset your password um, we are going to use this email and it is where we are going to send the important information that will help you to reset your password so ensure that you provide a valid email address and then 
of course your password and also confirm your password it's also very important to provide a strong password uh, it should be at least six characters you can include uh, lowercase uppercase uh, characters and also uh, numbers so a combination of that uh, will result to a very strong password okay so that is just um, the login system uh, which as i've mentioned should be in place uh, before now you start with the forget password so let's go to the important part and that is the forget password as you can see on the login page i have the forget password down here so if i click on this link i will be redirected to yet another page and this is the forget password uh, page so uh basically here I'll just be required to provide my valid email address so um, in this case you need to remember the email address that you provided while signing up or while registering unfortunately I mentioned again if you forget your email address then this process will not work for you so in here I'll just come and provide my email address and it is this one on top here and then i'll just click on recover password so if i click and upon ladder upon clicking on the recover password um, what will happen is that um, a link uh, to uh, the page where uh, i will reset my password will be sent to this specific email address so let me just click it and see what will happen so just click on I recover password so basically now it is trying to set that and as you can see it tells me that um, the email address did not match uh, that means that is not the email address that I provided it seems like it has a problem somewhere so i'll provide the email address again uh, so let me just do it again um, it at gmail.com so this is the specific email address that i have in the database so if i may just show you that i'll just go to the local host here and uh, within the database here uh, or within php my admin I have the database for gold password within which I have the table staff. This table has uh, the staff ID, the username, the mail, the password, and the activation. So the specific uh, password that I need to reset is this one. So in this case, I'm pretending that I cannot remember this specific password, and so I need to reset it. And as I mentioned, you need to have. Uh, provided an email address during registration so this is the specific email address um, that now matches this password so if I just come here and try now to set the email it will be sent because uh, this email address is the same that I'm providing here so you should always remember the email address so I'll just uh, confirm that again and it's good so I'll just say recover and remember all this as you can see it's happening in a local host uh, so you can also be able to do it online of course who should be the ultimate uh, 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 ding but in this case uh, I'm learning all these um, locally so using the, um, uh, the ZAMP uh, local host server yes so as you can now see it tells me that a password reset link was sent to your email so now i need to head on to my email so that i can be able to uh, see this link which i'll use to reset my password so uh, i have already opened my uh, specific email address or email account where i have or where i expect this link to be sent so I'll just go there and uh, i need uh, to refresh this i think because i cannot see it yet 
Yeah, so this is uh, my second email address. As you can see, it has a lot of emails that I have not read so far. Yeah, so it's my prime, it's my secondary uh, email address. Yeah, but it doesn't mean that uh, you need to use that. It's, that is, it's only because my primary one is attached to my YouTube uh, account, and I may not want to interfere with that as much. So I had to use my secondary email address yeah but it can happen with any valid email address so remember in uh, the upcoming videos i'll be showing you how you can be able to create this uh, forgot password uh, system uh, step by step so uh, you need to like look out for that so as you can see i already have the email sent to me the password is sent uh, here uh, the password is set rather so if i click on this to open it yeah you'll forgive me because my uh, internet is a little bit slow so i just hope you'll bear with me here yeah so i can also try to speed up this part so that we don't waste a lot of time here yeah as you can see password reset it is skills academy and uh, as you can see it tells me hello uh, someone requested to reset your password if this was you click here to reset your password if not just ignore the email so thank you it skills academy so i'll just come and click on uh, this link so this will open in a new tab as you can see and it's now trying to load uh, the page uh, where now i'll provide my new email address and one thing that i'll also need you to notice is that um, um, the email because i'm passing it through the link uh, has been encrypted so i'll be showing you how all that happens so that you don't uh, have uh, to showcase your, your 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 email address so if i point on this click link here you notice down here we have the specific link so we have the reset.php mail is equals so all this is uh, the specific email address but it has been encoded uh, and also we have the key uh, there it's also encoded so it is not uh, easier to, 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 to like share your information to people that you may not want so it is like secured so as you can now see I have the the reset uh, password I'm in the reset password page and here I'm just required to provide my new password and also confirm it down here we should not be seeing this information here in fact I should have it hidden but because in my subsequent videos I'll be showing you how to do this then we are going to fix that issue so I'll just come and provide my new email address i rather my new password so I can just come and say Yeah, so uh, of course this one should also be like this one. So there is also another issue there, but that's a very small thing to fix. Yeah, does it have uh, that big problem? Yeah, our aim is to ensure that this whole thing is working. So previously we were logging in using the password one two three four, but now we are changing it to this specific uh, password here. So just come and click on recover password. and that basically what it does is that it resets the password and i'm redirected to the login uh, page so now this is where i'm now supposed to log in with the new email address or rather the new password so i can just come and provide the username so that is uh, that and then the password the password as you can see here and then I can now try to log in yeah 
yeah and as you can see i'm successfully logged in into the system uh, using that specific uh, uh, new password that i have reset and it is as simple as that so um, that's what we'll be doing in our subsequent uh, videos uh, just trying to see how we can be able to reset or create a reset password system using php and mysql uh, step by step and i'll also take the same opportunity to like show you uh, how you can be able to uh, set an email using ZAMP because that's also another hurdle that comes in that you can create your reset password forgot password uh, system but you find that it is like not setting the email uh, to your email account so I'll be working or uh, walking you through the same so that we can be able to see how we go about that so um, having said that i think we are done uh, see you in the next one and as usual stay safe